welcome back to a new vlog with the Murillo twins. I'm Brianna. And I'm Brittany. And I know you guys missed us. Yeah, if you guys are OGs, you already know who's who. Kind of. Maybe, Can I, should you put, maybe I should put my wings to the side. side. Oh, me and you have opposite sides. Wow, that would happen to us. But I, I feel like I do normally do that side. It's because I'm left-handed. Brittany's right-handed, so we have our sides. Yeah, I you know? do it that way and hers goes that way. But, um, oh, and by the way, you guys, we've been letting our hair grow naturally, so no extensions. We haven't had extensions on, you guys. Look. But sometimes when we go out, we will apply them. It's just, which is rare. Yeah. When we do that. Sometimes even going out, we, we rock our natural hair. Yeah, and also our natural lashes, guys. We're natural queens. Oh my queen god, we're not fake no more. <laughs> we ain't we're not fake. fake. You can't call us fake no more. I'm just kidding. Minus all the surgery. I know. Like we, we're so fake. I'm just kidding. But anyways, um, so today's vlog is gonna be so cute. So I know that we did a vlog like years ago when um, Abby was little. He was yeah. about Hero's age right now, and I don't know if you guys can tell because we're looking like twins today. We're just alike. So we want to do an experiment, same one that we did with Evie. Um, you all know how to crawl, by the way. Now, shout out to my baby. Um, so we we want to. She would be the type to give him a shout out. Yeah, shout out to my baby. I want him to. We want to place him, and we really want to be like in front of him, kind of far apart, and let him decide if he knows who his mom is. Um, or he, I don't know if that really works or he's just gonna choose who he wants to go to but we want to see the look on his face because I think that would be so funny where he's just like I just feel like every kid is different and I just feel like I don't know Euro maybe doesn't know yet or maybe he does know that's why we, we want to see like where he's at if he could tell me and be a part mm -hmm. I was strong feeling I think, he's gonna come with me I think with with Evie um who did he want to go to think Namido yeah he ended up choosing Namido <laughs> no matter what he kept looking back for Namido yeah I was like oh my god if you guys want to check it out I think it's on our Murillo Twin channel yeah but we got to redo it with each kid, you guys. So that's what this video is going to be about. And we wanted to get in with what bras we are wearing. Sponsored by Skims, you guys. Shout out to Skims. We literally are obsessed with Skims. You guys already know we're like big, big fanatics of Skims. Okay, so I have the Fits Everybody Push-Up Demi Bra. This is what it's called. And I literally love, love, love the color. So you guys, me and Brittany were known to have big Gigi. And my back would always hurt with the push shit bras like literally all the time and i'm like dude like like when is someone gonna make a brand that can mm -hmm. like not make my back hurt and you guys skims like ever since me and Brittany found out about skims when they first launched yeah i'm gonna show you guys right now how it looks on but it's a push-up bra so it has comfortable padding you guys my back no longer hurts at all it has the hooks in the back, adjustable straps. Look at this, you guys. Look at how it gives me that umph up here. I am a mom of two, so my boobs have drastically, you know, they're sad now, you know? Wow. So, they are. But this push-up bra literally pushes up the girlies. It looks like I have a brand new boob job. Like, I can't believe how insane I could go down. My areolas don't come out. And it's so comfy. Look at this. So comfy. The bag, it fits so perfect. As for me, you guys, I'm obsessed with a weightless bra. So I got the weightless scoop bra. It does have a wire at the bottom. But I love something like this just to pick up my chichis. And it's not tight. It's very mm -hmm. comfortable. I have that one too. Literally. You have best. this one? Mm -hmm. I feel like you have to own every bra. Mm -hmm. in. And I love the, the material because it's mesh. Yeah, it's mesh. And you cannot see your nipples still. Like, like I have one on and you cannot see my nipples whatsoever. This is my bra, you guys. I love it. Like Bree said, I love when like, I bend down, bend forward. You guys, back in the day, I used to struggle with finding a perfect bra because my chichis would always come out. And finally, I found the perfect bra that fits my chichis. And like Bree was saying, like no back rolls, nothing showing. Also, I don't have like red um, or it's so super tight. So you guys don't have to have big boobs for these type of bras. You could literally be a member of the itty bitty committee. And this will literally be perfect for you, especially for girls that have, you know, smaller chest, just because I feel like it will hold it better and it's very lightweight and it seems like it's nothing. I feel like I'm not wearing anything, which makes it so comfortable. You know, when you get home and you want to take off your bra and you feel so good, that's how I feel like wearing this. So perfect. It has the back strap that you can 
It's adjustable. Those are our favorite bras right now that we recently been rocking like every single day, you guys. But they have plenty of other options. So, you guys, make sure to shop skims.com. And they are also available in 62 different sizes, ranging from 30A to 46H. And if you haven't yet, make sure to let them know we sent you. All you have to do is select YouTube in the survey. And be sure to select our channel in the drop down menu that follows. And like we mentioned, make sure to shop Skims bras at skims.com or we can list the link down below. So all you have to do is just click one button and it'll take you directly to the website. And without further ado, we're going to get on with the rest of the vlog. Let's see what these fellas are doing. What are you guys doing? Finally. You! We're Let's good. talk about how you were mad that oh you all preferred me. Good. Yeah, Let's we will. No against. I hope he says yeah again. Like, well, you said you game. wanted a rematch. You guys like rematch. we went to Vegas and I bought. My well, friend bought me this. It's a jersey of the Sandlot. But I was so sad because the dog didn't put his paw print signature. These are human signatures. I know, but he could have put his paw print right here or something. And he'll mess up the yeah, whole shirt. Yeah, you just woke up from a nap. Yeah. Hi, Mike. How are you feeling? Oh, it's not. You tired? I'm so tired. Papa's Papa's on your wave right now. I'm so tired. Yeah. Oh, just a little update with me. he has been going to school, you guys, and I've had a few calls from his teacher. Evie was never used to being around kids, so I feel like it's a little bit difficult, like transitioning him into school. So, yeah, we're dealing with that, you guys. Moms, let me know down below how you guys handle your your first time raise i know he's still four and he's young and he's new to school so he probably doesn't know a lot of the rules so i'm giving him grace but i'm like boy come on we gotta get it together because i don't know moms give me some tips because i've been stressing out so i think um because he's new like going to school and sharing and being with other kids you guys know he's a covid baby he was never around kids besides just and Jaden. but they're so much older than him i feel like he never really got to like have that connection with other children so pray for me guys i'm trying i'm trying to be the best mom i can but and i'm trying to be a gentle parent because i like gentle parenting since we got raised whooping like my what would you call those type of parents they don't gentle for shit so um that's where I'm at right now. And Brittany, I always, Brittany just to give me advice because she, her kids are older, but even her kids still give her drama as well. I'm trying, it never gets easier. Brittany says it gets harder. As they get older, it comes with more problems because they're older and they're more alert and aware, so they get into more trouble. So I'm, yeah. like, I'm still learning myself as I go. Yeah, so we're just learning together, but it's so difficult, mm, guys. Good. It's hard balancing, like, friendships, you know, being a parent, balancing family time, being a good wife, being a good mom, literally everything, work life, you know, especially with work, it's just like, I feel just all over the place and I know we can all relate, but I just feel like with Evian, I'm just like, oh my God. Uh, Euro wants to go with. Let's put no, let's do it over there where it's more sunny, lighter. I'm gonna show you guys what we're wearing. This is what I'm wearing, these big, oh, I don't know what, but I like them. They're like super. I like when they're oversized like that. Mine's are oh, super oversized. Me, we just said denim jeans and a white shirt. So okay, that's what we're wearing. Yeah, Brittany chose to fit. Same I wonder if he knows. Hair. Yeah, since she hair, everything like. So let's see. Wait, I want to put my phone. So I want the camera to get him. Okay. Okay. Wait, let me be on the carpet too, cause I don't want his knee to hurt, and then that's the reason why he goes to you. Okay. okay. <laughs>
too much for him. We will. Make babies. We will. Come here, mommy. We will. Make babies. Look at He's like, yeah, right. Come here, mommy. Right there. You know what I mean, mommy? Make No, you're a chick. Get in with the girl. We will. Yeah, we will. We will. Come here. Come here. Aww. I'm sorry. We Okay, Vente, come on. Vente, Vente. I think we, I think he's really scared that we're twins. Are you scared that we're confusing? He doesn't know that who's his mom. Vente, mi amor. Vente. Do you want to come with mom? Yeah? And he's... Oh, it's because you're new. No, he wants, he wants to be soon. Yeah, maybe. That was too much commotion for it's you. It's because you think that's your mommy, you have two mommies? Is that what you're thinking in your head? Don't worry, that was, we overstimulated him. I'm sorry, look at the tears. Okay, uh, you know, let, let me tell you something. I'm your real mommy. Who's your real mommy? Um, can I be your real mommy? Yeah? yeah. I'm sorry, I'm look at this teardrop. So, I, no. think, I think the race was too long for him. <laughs> we needed to start at small, like he's eight months. Nancy, put it down. I think like, he needs to come He needs to start from right here. Let's put the camera back down. Okay. Let's start from right there. We're going to do a baby race. No, you look, you look at your movie right back right still. Here. Okay, there. Okay. Come here. Come here. We won't be too uh, dramatic. Yeah. Let him just choose. Let him just choose. Don't do all that. He's going to grab the fucking camera. <laughs> we won't win. Yeah, come here. <laughs> you chose the camera. Yeah, how are you choosing the camera, girl? No, girl, that's not how it works. You're too cute, my dog. Minty. You little. guys, I'm sorry. Our little experiment failed. If Ramiro was here, or if he's I want her and Ramiro to do it. I know, me too. You're so cute. We gotta wait for Ramiro to, to step in. But I think, okay, the, what do you guys think? Comment down below. I really believe that he either one, we were too like overstimulating him, like he started getting scared. Yeah, or, we were scaring him off. Or two, he really was concerned who his mom was. Like, we started scaring him. Like, why is there two of us? You know what I mean? Yeah. Those, that's what I believe. What do you think? I do think that I felt like he's scared. Because even when he first seen us in the room, he was hella eyeing me and you like this. Yeah, he was looking at us like that. You guys, when, we, when my mom brought him I wish we could have recorded him. Because me and Brie really look alike. Kind of like we're matching. Huh. I'm sorry, my fat boy. All right. Oh, why did you matter? Okay, little so outfit. He's, he's somewhere ready. Hey guys, so it is the next day. It's Sunday, by the way, but guess what I woke up to? To urgent care because I noticed the past few days, Giro like cries in the middle of his sleep and I know he's in a stage where he's like teething a lot. Like all his front teeth are coming in. So he has the first eight and then these, the canines are coming in. So my little baby, that's why he's been fussy crying at night. And yesterday I noticed a super white tongue. And I've always known about that because my mom always has told me about that. Of what that could be. So I was like, sorry, it's because I'm eating McDonald's. So I don't want food to be like coming out. I'm covering my mouth. Hold on, baby, we're going to get off. So, um, long story short, he was, I gave him Tylenol yesterday because he was just so fussy. And I was like, okay, whatever, you know. And... Again, like at 4 a.m., he woke up crying. And Euro never wakes up crying. Like, never. And I'm like, what has been going on with him? Like, he, he moves too much. Just all of that. I'm like, something's not right. I gave him Tylenol again at like 4 in the morning because that helps him sleep. So then this morning, I noticed his tongue super white and like little white, like almost like blister like. And I was like, okay, I know what he has. Thrush. Well, I, I'm assuming it's thrush. I don't know. I'm here at urgent care to get him like some 
antibiotics because it, I don't know if you guys are aware thrush is like a yeast infection and you're all crawls now so he's always crawling like maybe after he crawls he puts his hands back in his mouth it's just really dirty and I, I try to do the best I can but you know babies are gonna be babies they put everything in their mouth like literally anything and I'm just like ah like oh my god you guys I feel so bad for him you know so I'm like I'm gonna take him immediately to um urgent care so that's where we're at and I'll let you guys know how it goes okay um, Fernando stayed back with um, Evian because um, it's just gonna be too many people in there in the urgent care. Fernando's parents did come um, for the weekend, so we spent time with them, but they left early morning because you know Sacramento is like so far away, so they have to leave early because they work tomorrow. But that's just to update you guys on everything. I'm just gonna eat my sausage maker. I don't really eat. Um, McDonald's, but because I hadn't ate this morning, and I know I'll probably spend quite a while here at Urgent Care. I'm like, let me grab some quick breakfast. Mm. So good. I remember off topic, but when we used to work at McDonald's, we were offered a meal for free every day, so I never had to pay for lunch. Guys, I worked at McDonald's for three years. I would, every day of my shift, I would get a free meal. So I would eat McDonald's. Every day. That's so bad. Like, I always think, oh my god. But that's when I was like 16 to like 18. Now I think about it like... Bro. I don't know how I didn't get so big. And I substitute my... Sausage, egg, and cheese maker all with round egg. Mm, yeah. I'm just trying to eat really quick before I go in because I'm not going to be able to eat in there. Yeah. Hi, baby. Look at his tongue, you guys. No, not the camera. You're obsessed with the camera. No. 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 I'm thin. Look at his tongue. So white. My little boy, he's so cute. So we're at the Virgin Care already. Hopefully they see him soon, cause I feel bad for my baby. I feel bad for you. I don't want you to be hurting. I don't want you to be hurting. Okay, guys, so I don't know if I've updated you guys, but they confirmed that it was a thousand percent thrush. Um, so then I came to my nearest Walgreens, but then the the prescription wasn't ready yet. So they're like, just come back in 15 minutes. And then I seen a, what's it called? A um, Big Lot um, right in front. And the Big Lot said like 50% off, store closing. I'm like, mm, let's see what I can find. So we got off. You're all sleeping, by the way. Thank God, the whole the whole way he was sleeping the whole time and I got some diapers for six bucks oh my god you guys I'm sweating can you see this gloss I'm not sweating but it's like oils from the sun but um yeah I got a few things I got I'm gonna go home now I'm gonna do a Sunday reset edit this vlog and then I'm gonna do laundry clean up the house and uh, friends having a sports team okay I secured the meds so thank god that's done 
Um, I'm gonna start giving him his meds every four hours. Um, it's a medicine, like some liquid medicine, so I have to drop it in his cheeks each side every six hours. So I hope I hope that helps you guys because I feel so bad. I heard thrush hurts so bad. My mom was telling me that she's had that before and she was, oh my god. But anyways, I was saying, we're gonna have um, a Sunday reset and then Fern is just gonna watch sports all day since football is back and you guys know that that's part of his job is to um, do, what's it called? Sports? Like, whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm gonna start heading um, off the road now, or on the road, and I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!